sort of, I guess, the final morning of uh, a little expedition down to Coffs Harbour. Heading out with Ben, a few of the other boys. Just cruising out in the morning. See if we can get a few more mackerel for the day. Hopefully we can get a Spanish this time. We've been getting spotties all week, so a Spanish would be a lovely, lovely treat. So see how we go. Spanish in the past it's a sort of a little drop-off uh, they seem to like to hang out and uh, yeah hopefully we can convert these slimies into something something pretty decent today Fish on here. Let's hitch this. I think it could be a little spotty. That's why the feel. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Big head shakes. Big head shakes going on. Really not happy down there. I can just feel him shaking his head. Take it slowly, you just gotta work him up. Oh, just gotta bring him up. I think we're getting close to him. Hopefully. Yeah, look at that, she's a nice Spanish. Good fish. Shot. Oh, yeah, baby. Yeah, look at that. Nice Spanish right there. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. No, 
nice shot of him in the sun there. Oh, good, good Spanish mackerel. Nice size fish. Well, I think it could be home time. It's uh, getting pretty wet. Pretty wet and windy out here now. The sun is really picking up and as you can see, it's, it's getting really messy, but you know, totally worth it. We ended up with a nice Spanish this morning. So happy with that. You know, I've been trying to get one for the last, you know, month or two. Conditions haven't been ideal this season and it's, it's fantastic to finally pick one up on what uh, most likely will be my, my last trip out before winter comes. So yeah, couldn't be more happy with that. We'll uh, just slowly push our way back into shore and the southerly should uh, bring us on home and um, yeah, just have to play the waiting game and come back next year. So, hope you enjoyed the little video. It's sort of the uh, first of uh, a little fishing blog series that I'm uh, going to start posting up and uh, yeah, we'll catch you next time.